What's up guys, Liam here, and it's my birthday. Woo! So, we have a very interesting day today. We are going to Ghetto Golf in Birmingham. And, what's the other thing, babe? Bottomless brunch. Yes, where's that? Dirty martini. There you go. This picture of Christians just put up. Woo! Cheers. 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 I hope I'm not in that. <laughs> you might be able to put something over your face or something. <clears throat> Starting off the day with the next day um, with some scrambled egg on toast. Toast. With a monster, because it's already like lunchtime, we just haven't eaten yet. Um, and that's it really. We're going to the cinema tonight. We've had a very interesting kind of few days. We've gone um, Ghetto Golf yesterday, would definitely recommend. It was unreal, it was mad. Um, we went to Bottomless Brunch. Um, that was really good. We had like, what, like nine drinks in 90 minutes? Eight yeah. drinks. I think we had eight, didn't we? For 30 squids. Yeah, for 30 quid as well, so that was real good. We're going to the cinema tonight. Sick. Show that lid room! Come here. Show the people how clever you are. Sit. Good boy. Give me your paw. No paw. Paw. Good boy. What about that one? Hey! Sit. Paw. Give me a paw. Good boy. What about that one? You have one. Good boy. So over the past like 24, not 24 hours, more like 48. Nah, okay. Okay, who, who am I kidding? More like the past week. Over the past kind of week, we've definitely put on um, a few pounds. Whether that's water weight, just general volume of food still in my stomach. Um, and definite... Tub gone back on around the face. We've consumed loaded fries. We have had large pizza with stuffed crust. We have had a Chinese takeaway. We have had, uh, what, what was that thing called? Bottomless brunch. We have had cocktails for days. We have just been enjoying ourselves. And I'll tell you what, I do not regret that one bit. We will get to that a little bit later. I'm going to tell you exactly why that's okay, right? Trust me, they, you know, it, it all makes sense. There's method to my madness, you know. Drop the video a like because it's my birthday and all that. And uh, we'll get to that in uh, in a minute. Just thought I'd document, you know, final few minutes of being 21 years old. Technically I was born at 2 p.m. But, you know, everybody knows that your B-Day starts and you officially are one year older as of midnight. So, what time is it, babe? Have a look. My phone's all the way over there. All the way over there. It's right next to you in the bed. <laughs> That's all. Okay. Signing off. LSJ, signing out. <laughs> okay, so as it is my actual birthday now, this is like video inception. A minute ago, I was here in the same t-shirt talking to you. Then it wasn't my birthday. Then it was my birthday. Now then, then it wasn't. And like now it is. So, you know. Oh, the meal! I haven't shown you the meal! Right, okay, so... This is going really, really well. I'll, I'll just play the clips, and I'll see you guys in a minute.
disastrous experience. Sing to me then. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Liam. Happy birthday to you. Woo! Oh. <laughs> oh. I can't do that one. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> mm. Sorry guys, I just had to take a break there to just consume a few more calories, you know. I uh, feel like I've not had enough over the past few days and so just had to had to top it up with a bit of birthday cake. So um, as you can see by the title, and probably guess from what I've already said in today's video, um, I've taken a break from the diet, um, and again, you, you know, you can probably tell, you can probably see, you can probably guess that I've, I've gained a few pounds. I honestly haven't weighed myself, I have no clue how much I weigh right now, and to be honest, I couldn't care less. Taking a little break from it, so what? It's, it's the middle of, you know, I worked really hard in the run-up to body power. It's my birthday, it's my dad's birthday tomorrow, as the day of filming this, you know, my birthday and the old man's birthday is the next day. And then it's mum's birthday, you know, we're doing a lot of things around about now, and so I'm going to be taking it easy. Well, I'm kind of getting back on it with like cardio and stuff tomorrow, but in terms of just not worrying about if, about having a pizza, like if I wanted a pizza in this past few days, I've had a pizza. And likewise, you know, myself and Charlotte had a Chinese as well, and it's really not that big of a deal, you know. How much damage can you do in a few days? I mean, yeah, technically speaking, quite a lot if you kind of just hit, if you go ham on it, you know. Um, but I have been kind of sensible with it. I've been doing, um, I've been active, you know. I've not just been doing nothing with my days, sat in bed and still consuming all of these calories. I've been active, going out and doing stuff. Um, you know, I have trained a couple of times, but then at the same time, they've kind of been hippie sessions, like, oh, I'll do, you know, three or four sets on this, I'll, I'll do another one of them because it was feeling good. It wasn't really a structured kind of session, it was just getting the blood pumping, keeping things kind of ticking over, shall we say. Um, so yeah, we've taken a break from the diet, but we are technically back on it as of tomorrow, right? I'm back at work tomorrow, I actually took this whole week off. Um, you get your birthday paid off w w where I work anyway, so that's, that's really good, right? Um, and I figured why not take the rest of the week off to make some content and just enjoy some kind of time away. Um, I say make some content, but I have taken kind of the past two or three days, um, I've taken it easy with social media. I haven't filmed much, I haven't put much up on social media. So I guess you could kind of say I'm taking a break from, from like everything rather than just the diet. But um, no, the plans for the diet, um, for the foreseeable future are to lose another few pounds. I mean, kind of get back to where we were around about 172, 173, um, because I should imagine we're around 178 now with all the water weight and extra food and all that kind of stuff. I should imagine we're at, at least 178, kind of just blown up a bit by a few pounds, you know, which is, again, no big deal. But the plan, I'm thinking 165. I'm thinking that, and that's quite low. That would be the lowest I've weighed probably since I was like 14, 13, 14. Um, and it's a bold move. Um, I don't think it would by any means get where it wouldn't. It's only like another 10 pounds. It would not get me shredded, you know? That is still not the goal. The goal is to enjoy life, enjoy training, have that balance, because to be honest, in the first couple of years, it's something that I just didn't have, and I told myself I did, um, and I, w I would just not train, I'd be going out having this great social life, and then I wouldn't balance that out with the training, you know? Hence first year fat, hence the, uh, the bloat, shall we say, to put it nicely, over the past kind of few years at uni. I'm not at uni anymore, and so technically this is gonna be the easiest opportunity I have to lose weight. I have the home gym, 
at my disposal day and night. I have the spin bike. I have. I can do whatever I want. I can film whatever I want. I can train whatever I want. You know, I don't have to go. How many sets you got left, bro? If I want to do some bench press, I can do some bench press. I don't have to wait for a rack. You know, and I'm very fortunate to be in that position. So I'm looking forward to actually utilizing the equipment I have available to me. I have my new plan set in stone or just about i think i'm going to tweak a couple more bits because i'm really really picky i want this to be really good i've been working on it freaking ages and i want it to be something that maybe we could all benefit from rather than just myself um but bearing in mind the plan will be kind of my plan but hey so yeah, we're taking a break from the dive, but we're getting back on it tomorrow. Um, we've definitely put on a few pounds, but I think it's good because I was kind of getting to the point where I was, I was not bored of it, but I needed like a break, not some sort of you know refeed. I probably needed a refeed, um, but then at the same time, the, a refeed and what I've done is you know completely different but it like i say it is what it is sometimes life gets in the way and that's just what's happened with with me right now and that's not the end of the world it's monday tomorrow we'll start with a new week new plan new training sessions let's go let's smash it i'm looking forward to it guys i, I really really freaking am looking forward to it um there's a lot of stuff that i've planned that's kind of coming to the surface now um and a lot of stuff that are planned for also kind of in the future that can happen hopefully a bit sooner as well. So it's gonna be good, it's gonna be exciting um, and I am very, very much looking forward to smashing this next phase of my training and just getting a little bit leaner, you know? Hopefully getting rid of the love handles whilst maintaining as much strength as possible. But hey, we shall see, we'll see how that goes. I might have to sacrifice the ego for the abs, but don't we all? Hey, we've all been there. Let me know your thoughts on what I should do, whether you think 165 is a good kind of weight for me to be at. Uh, bearing in mind I'm only five foot six, you know, I'm a short guy, and so realistically speaking, that's that's not really that light. You know, there's other people around my height that are in the 150s and, you know, 160s bulked up, and, and I'm nowhere near that. So, um, you know, different builds and all that kind of stuff, but. We shan't go into that, that's a separate separate kind of video. So, um, I wanted to take this time as well to thank you all for your support over the body power period. The, I uploaded eight, de wow, okay, start again. I uploaded eight videos in eight days, uh, which was a real, real, real grind, especially with, you know, the internet and the hotel going down, and there was just a, just a few things that crop up that you guys tend not really to see, um, but we managed it, we did it, and I'm very, very proud of myself, and I have no shame in saying that I am very happy with myself, I'm very proud of, of that achievement, if you like, you know, because daily uploads are hard, people don't see the effort that goes into these videos, um, not all the time anyway, but thank you guys so much for your support, it really does keep me going, thank you so freaking much, I love every single one of you, whether you subscribed yesterday, whether you subscribed tomorrow, or like two years ago, I love you all, thank you so much, together we will grow, thank you so much also for the birthday messages, because it's, that's mad you know, right, this is why you guys are the freaking best, right, I have had more messages from you guys, people that I've either met like last week at Body Power like once, met once or twice, right, or have never met in my entire life. I've had more messages saying happy birthday and none of you guys knew it was my birthday. I've had ha happy birthday messages from so many of you guys and so many of my close close friends at home haven't, um, haven't even messaged me or anything like that and it's like nearly the end of the day now. But um, yeah, thank you guys, I love you. Together we will grow and I will see you in the next one.